Shalom. I want to start off by giving all honor, praises, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakakadash. Double honors to our elders and apostles for teaching us the truth of this Bible. A citation to the elect, pushing his word to the best of your ability. Hey, Khan, so today, you know, just, just going over a bunch of uh, videos I compiled up, you know. Basically, be videos and articles, you know. Basically, so this is going to be on how the, the race wars is going down, you know. And we see all kind of, it's all kind of stuff, you know. Let me see, it was uh, last week, there was this uh, video of this nigga woman on the bus beating down this uh, Edomite lady. Let me see. Uh, so here, here's just uh, uh, some of the videos I, I put together, you know. What does it say? Uh, this is about again, May 17th. Or oh, uh, edit again, edit again, you know. Uh, that's 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 the uh, that's the title, you know. Edit again, you know. Hispanic customer giving uh, Starbucks order with a racial slur written on his cup, you know. And if as you see, it says Beaner on it. You no, know, he's Edomites so is super proud right there, you know. And you Jakes, man, you just it's gonna take some. Uh, it's it's gonna take some huge for you to finally finally wake up. So let me see a mother and her son. This is back on May 17th. A mother and her son were driven off the road, attacked and called racial slurs, you know. Jake is so just 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 surprised that all this is going down, you know. <laughs> it's uh June the 21st, you know, racist man blocks black doctor from entering her gated community because he thinks she doesn't live there. Man, hey, it's 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 so many of these. Let's let's start out with this. Is uh Matthew 24 and 7 for nation shall rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom. God. And what what nations, you know, mainly, mainly is is you you Israelites, you know, the nation of Israel, you so-called blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans, versus mainly the nation of, of Edom. The nation of Edom, you Edomites, you so-called white people, you know, but we know. You know, it's going to be all, all you healing, you know, because I'm about to get into that. I'm about to get to this scripture in a minute. But basically, you know, it's going to be all you healing, you know, you, 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 uh, so-called Chinese, you so-called, so-called, uh, Japanese, you know, you know, you, uh, so-called, uh, East Indians, you know, you so-called Japhites. I mean, it's like a you, you Jephites, you so-called Filipinos, you know, you so-called Samoans, Tongans, you know. It's going, it's going to be, it's going to be all out race wars out here, man. You know, so it's it's uh, Matthew twenty-four and seven. For nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom, and there shall be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. Kind. So this is the time we in right now. That's all you. Every time you look up. It's just another, another uh, big earthquake somewhere, you know. The 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 uh, magnitudes of these earthquakes is hitting a lot, a lot harder, you know. There are a lot bigger earthquakes. You know, a couple of years ago, I can remember going online and it's mostly just like 2.0s, 2.0s. Now they're up to, it's mostly just showing like four, five point oh's, you know. But uh, back to the to the subject, you know, race wars, you jakes, man, you better wake up, you know, you're not going to have no choice but to wake up, you know, like as I say coming up, as a script we're going to pull out, you know, you're going to be forced to wake up, so this is another one, this is go back to June 29th, racist California man goes off on a Latino man after car incidents, stupid fucking Mexican. You no, know, you you so-called Mexicans are from the tribe of Ishikar, you know. It's no coincidence that all 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 you you so-called Latinos are catching this same racist hate from these 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 Edomites, man. You know these so-called white people. It's no coincidence, you know. You know, so the whole time you you thought you was over here, you know you. You want to uh, be the, the so-called white man's pet, you know? You want them to basically pet you on the head, you know, and look at you, call, say that you're better than the so-called black man, you know? The Judites that's over here, 
in America, you know, catching all this racial hell. Now, now you going through it, you know. Esau, Esau, uh, Esau really don't give a damn about about you so-called Northerners, you know. It's so, like okay, you, you, you Northerners. Esau really don't give a damn. He, he's just letting it be known, you know. I mean, over the last week or two, it's it's been it's been numerous. It just it seems like every single day you wake up, it's just all kinds of uh. Let me see uh all kinds of racist stuff going on. Let me see uh Slucky. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, okay, so we got that. July the fifth. Was this last week? It keeps it keeps happening. Just look at the <laughs> look at these uh titles to these videos, man. You know? It keeps happening. White man calls cops on black woman because she didn't want to show him her ID to prove she's a resident of the neighborhood. <laughs> you know, hey man. It's, it's good it's good for for you tribes, man. You know, for from our apostles or Dell, you know, been telling you we're on these streets for years, you know, prophesying, telling you that this stuff was going to happen, you know, prophesying, telling you that this so-called white man never gave a damn about you, never will, you know, and that there's going to be a race war, you know, and now we, we're in, we're, we're in that time where things is amping up, you know, something is going to happen, something is going to happen to where well, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans are gonna, gonna finally, you're gonna finally wake up, you know, and do what you gotta, do what you gotta do, you know. Cause we know if it was up to y'all, nothing would never, uh, nothing with this race war would ever get done, you know. So let me see, uh. So this is uh, Genesis 49 and 9. Judah is a lion's whelp. From the prey, my son, thou art gone up. He stooped down. He couched as a lion. And as an old lion, who shall rouse him up? Huh, and Judah, as you so-called Negroes, you know, you so-called blacks, you so-called Negroes in and it says Judah is a lion's whelp, you know. Basically, here's an old lion right now, you know. And an old lion, you know, old lion pretty much, you know, and it had his battles, you know, it's pretty much pretty much on the on the just chilling in, you know, just relaxing, you know. He leaves the the battle up to the young lion, you know. So it says, Who shall rouse him up, you know? And your Hawba Shemil Shai is gonna have to put the spirit, have to put the spirit in you to get this race war going, cause that's that is the that's the order, you know. You're you you are no Judah is the top tribe, you so-called blacks, you know. You're gonna get this race wars kicked off. And just like just like all the trends, all the 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 uh, uh previous race wars in this country, you know. The North, North is going to have the so-called Latinos are going to have no choice but to to follow you. You know that's that's what they're going to do. But it's the order to it. You know, Judah is going to have to get roused up first. You know, and like I said, you how about Shemuel Shai is going to put that spirit on you to to be as a young lion. You know, and we're about to get into that a little later. We're about to get into that a little later. That scripture. But basically, you know, how about Shemesh is gonna have to put the spirit on you because, because it's just all these, all these different instances that just keep pulling out, you know, and you, you just, you know, you keep on having these damn protests, these hands up, no shoot, you know, hands up, don't shoot, hands up, don't shoot, you know, it, it's, this shit is, this shit is embarrassing, man, you know. When has uh, these these protests ever helped? They've never helped, man. No, so this is uh, July the seventh. This is a few days ago. Make America 
great again. Kids at Trump's Matello, Matano rally call for border wall because Mexicans are overpopulating us. Huh, so this video, you know, these, these little, you know what? We can just, we're going to play it. What are the issues that are most important to you uh, that Donald Trump has brought up this year? Um, I mean, the little wall, we don't want Mexicans. No. <laughs> or illegal immigrants. Uh-huh. And so why is that important to you? Because we already have enough people. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and the Mexicans are coming over here and overpopulating us. Yeah, man. So you 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 heard it out of the you heard it out of the mouth of of, of these little so called white kids. You know, you heard it out of the mouth of these little Edomite kids that they don't like you. You know. So let me see. Uh, let me pull that out. Yeah, this shit car, man, you've been, you so-called Mexicans been really, you've been really, uh, you've been catching a bunch of, uh, a bunch of these incidents going on lately, you know? And you know, like you say, you thought you were, you thought you were better than so-called blacks, you know? Now you catching the same, you catching the same hell, if not more. This is, uh, Ciroc 12 and 10. Never trust thine enemy, for like as iron rusted, so is his wickedness come. And your enemy, you know, what Jake fails to realize, you know, is these 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 dusty, dirty looking, grimy crackers, you know, who you think you are your are your friends. They're your they're your enemies, man. You know? I don't, I don't what what more do you need to see to tell that this these devils are your enemies, man? You know? I mean, come on, man. Though he humble himself and go crouching, yet take good heed and beware of him. Come. So Esau, Esau, you know, that's a characteristic of your enemy. You know, clearly these damn Edomites, they go crouching, you know. Like it says, they they uh they come with smooth words, you know, but war was war is in their heart. You know, they go crouching, you know. Edomite might open up the door for you, you know, say, hey, hey, hi, good morning, you know. If you're spiritual, you can see it's all, it's all BS. But it says, yet take good heed and beware of him, and thou shalt be unto him as if thou had wiped a looking glass, and thou shalt know that his rust hath not been altogether wiped away. God, so, you know, you, you just take good heed of this Edomite, man, these devils. And you're going to, you're going to, uh, instance, you're going to see that this devil is your, your enemy, you know? All of them, man. You know, our people, our people who had to say, you just had the same damn line, you know? It's the same line over and over, you know? All of them are not, all of them aren't the same, you know? All of them aren't the same. All white people aren't bad, you know? They say if the only, if, if there is an actual, uh, so-called white person that is actually being good to you, whatever, you know, you vibing with them or whatever, then that's, that's, that's uh, mostly it's going to be a, a Israelite, you know? Let me see, uh, a confusion the face. Let's uh, go to, uh, let me see, is that it? Okay, come on. And it just, the list goes on, man. So this is uh, July 10th, this is today, yep. Neighbor calls cops on 12-year-old black kid for delivering newspapers and acting suspicious. You know? <laughs> I mean, man, I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know what more you, you, you tribes need to see. Let's go to another one. Uh, it says, yesterday. Oh, yeah, it says yesterday. Uh, shaking my head. Uh, white man harasses a Puerto Rican at a park and asks if she's an American citizen. Yeah, I seen this video. This dude, this Edomite don't give a yeah. I mean, these Edomites don't give a damn, man. They, they, they're, uh, they're turning up right now, man. You know, on a, on a higher level than they've been. You know, and you tribes are just turned. You turned all the way down, man. You know, you got no volume coming out of you. And uh, yeah. So this, you know, you so called Puerto Ricans. You, 
known as the tribe of Ephraim, you know. This Ephraim, my lady, you know, just just over here at the park, this uh, Edomite over here, uh, over here, basically, you know, like, hey, you you need to go back to Puerto Rico, you know, you know, and just you tribes is so surprised. You seem so surprised in these videos, man. It's just crazy. It's just crazy. Like, what more do you need to see? Let me see. Let me see. Okay. I think this is that video. Oh, yeah, you all remember this, you know. This video right here that came out, I believe, like a month ago. This is my lady, you know, seeing this, this little, uh, dude out there that they adopted. You know, they know she's treating them like it's, it's a dog, you know. Showing you how they see you, see you tribes. You know, it's like I said, it's not a coincidence that that uh that what you so called uh he's doing Esau has videos up against you so called Puerto Ricans, uh, you so called Mexicans, you know, and you so called blacks, man. You know, you all the same. You all from the tribe, the tribes. It's like you all from the twelve tribes, you know, the tribe of Israel. You know, you're all Israelites, man. You're the same damn people. You know. So let me see, uh, ABC7, um, oh yeah, yeah, and this, uh, San Francisco construction worker alleged racist graffiti harassment on the job. Basically some, some evil devils was putting, uh, some dolls on nooses and hanging them in the bathroom, you know. And these, these, man, seem so surprised somewhat. I can't believe this is 2018, you know. You know, man, you, hey, man, we're about to get to the scripture in a minute. Let me see, uh, oh, yeah, this is, this is from, uh, yesterday, July the 9th. This is, uh, from the San Francisco Gate. I'm trying to scan it. It's not loading. But, uh, skateboard used as weapon in alleged San Francisco hate crime. A skateboard was used by a teenager to assault a man on Market Street near the intersection on Kearney Street in San Francisco on Sunday. Authorities on Monday were investigating a hate crime against a white man in San Francisco after a teenager allegedly beat him with a skateboard and made racial statements. Let me get to the point. Let me see, uh... So basically, it says the authorities identified the assailant as Latino, but the suspect fled the scene before officers arrived. God. So, you know, it is it is some uh, it is some of you uh, blacks and Latinos, you know, doing some things on the on the low right now, you know. It's not just all out. Like everybody, you know, all all our people ain't ain't sleep, you know. So let me see. Right, so this is another uh, article, you know, basically from June the thirtieth. A white woman called police on a twelve-year-old for mowing grass. And it's 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 so much more that I didn't even I didn't even pile up, you know. I believe it was one where a uh, little Edomite, no, a boy, a little. Judite girl was selling lemonade. Got the police called on her. You know, it's just hey man. Like I said man, we in that time. Well, you try, you, you know, Judah, you're gonna get roused up. Y'all boy, some y'all shit gonna put the spirit on you to rouse up. You other tribes, you're not gonna have no choice. But you're going to join. You know, you going, you just waiting. You just waiting for Judah basically. So this is uh, Micah 5 and 7. And the remnant of Jacob shall be in the midst of many people as a dew from the Lord. As it showers upon the grass that tarrieth not for men, nor waiteth for the sons of men come. So this is basically going into gentrification, you know, because there's a bunch of uh, areas you go to, you used to go to, you know, and it would be predominantly Edomites, you know. It'd be like their city. You know, you hardly see any Jakes. Now you go to those same cities. 
you see <laughs> you see uh jake all over you see jake on the corner smoking smoking blunts you know you see ishikar on the corner smoking blunts you know you'll see uh judo on the corner smoking blunts you just hey you the tribes man it, it's it, you all getting intermingled you know it says uh and the remnant of jacob shall be among the gentiles in the midst of many people gone so like it said uh you uh so-called blacks latinos and native americans you know you're getting you're you're uh you're moving into some of these Edomite neighborhoods, you know, and like these Edomites, you know, uh, I, I personally, I live on the street, you know, well, mostly, uh, Jake's, you know, but now all of a sudden you got all these, these Edomites, oh, you got some Moabites, you know, you got some Elamites all on the same lot, you got some Japhites, it's, it's, uh, oh, you got Ishmael, you pretty much got every every uh nation on our block now all of a sudden you know and uh you know this is basically you know you how about shimmer shy getting this the stage set you know you moving these pieces in the right places you know and the remnant of jacob shall be among the gentiles in the midst of many people as a lion among the beasts of the forest as a young lion among the flocks of sheep gone like I said, Jake, man, y'all, y'all, y'all are in the mist, man. You right in the mist. You know, you're not gonna have, to, you're not gonna have to go to uh those places back in the day that you would have to go to to see an Edomite. You know, you live next door to Edomites. You live next door to Moabites. You know, they're all right there. You know, in the midst of many people, as a lion among the beasts of the forest as a young lion among the flocks of sheep gone so you just you just picture a, a young lion you know amongst a flock of sheep you know the lion that young lion is going to tear going to tear them uh their sheep to pieces man you know it's not going to be any type any any chance man you know it's not going to be no contest who if he go through both tread it down and tear it in pieces, and none can deliver. Come, so ain't nobody, you know, you, 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 you other nations, man. You gonna, you gonna get destroyed in this race wars, man. You know, and, and you know, you, you already see it, man. You know, Jake is already stronger than you other nations. You know, these other nations, hey, they don't want it, man. You know, that's why Esau got got these guns. You know. Esau can't go hand to hand. Well, that's what happens once Esau's bullets run out, you know? Yeah, man. So basically, man, you, you, you other nations, man, just, you know, you, you're going to get destroyed in this race war, man. Jacob, man, you, Jake, you, you finally going to wake up, man, from this deep sleep that you in, man, you know? And you're going to get off on these other nations, man, you know? So, you know, I just want to thank you, how about Shimei Shai? You know, I just want, it's so like, I want to say, the water you how about Shimei Shai for putting the Holy Spirit on me to recall Kadash to do this lesson. You know, double honors to our elders and apostles for teaching us the truth of this Bible. And citation to elect push his word to the best your ability. Shalom.